What's up, gamers and gamers? It's your boy Izzy D Gamer here once again, bringing you another episode of Izzy Reacts, and that's right. Today, we're going to be getting into something special once again, straight from Disney themselves, Marvel Studios. We're about to get into the official trailer to Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness with Benedict Cumberbatch as the lead. You know we're super excited for something like this, scheduled for a 2022 release, but it's already been pushed back a couple of times. So we are not going to stay too committed to that, but we know that a lot of information is supposed to be revealed. Will the mutants be revealed in this movie? Will we see another Spider-Man? Will we see Daredevil, Kingpin? Will we see maybe some faces that we've never seen before? Some new character reveals, things like that. Why is Jane Foster in the movie? Or sorry, not Jane Foster. Jeez, I always forget her name. Yeah, we've, we've got so many questions um, and so much build up to this movie. This has been like, this is supposed to be just like an Avengers movie or something like that for phase four. So... With that, you know, we have to expect kind of like big good things to happen in this movie. Um, but, you know, I don't want to get too much into the speculation this time around. I know I love to do that. You know, I love to theorize. But it just seems like there's so much possibility in the multiverse of madness that truly anything could happen. You know, the Fantastic Four can be revealed. Um, and maybe that can lead into their films coming out later since um, John Watts is then directing... It seems like he's done directing the Spider-Man films and he will be moving on to Fantastic Four. has been confirmed by Kevin Feige. Uh, it's a completely different language to people who don't really pay attention to the uh, Marvel Universe. But you know I do. I'm super excited for it. This is all stuff that you can look up. And I'll make sure to layer a couple of things out in case you, are, in like, in case you have a little interest. But um, I don't want to get... Like I said, I don't want to get too deep into all the going-ons. I've already been talking for like three minutes. So let's get into the trailer, and then we can talk after. Shoot. Every night, I dream the same dream. Man. Kaecilius? The nightmare begins. Dream the same dream and then the nightmare begins, huh? What to do? To protect our world. You cannot control everything, Strange. You open Director, the same Raimi, man. And we don't know who or what will walk through it. There goes Wong. Wanda. What do you know about the multiverse? Viz had his theories. He believed it was dangerous. He was right. I'm sorry, Stephen. Your desecration of reality will not go unpunished. What the frick is this? tell him the truth. Okay, so we are in a new dimension. God, that looks trippy. That looks trippy. Things just got out of hand. Who is that? Who is this playing? You break the rules. Look out! Okay, okay, this is um Fudge. I forgot her name. I forgot her name. That doesn't seem fair. America Chavez. Wong. We got a Wanda, but was that an X? I, we gotta slow down on the uh... Oh shoot, that's Evil Strange. That's definitely Evil Strange. Um, okay, so that was the Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness official trailer featuring Benedict Cumberbatch, of course, a bunch of other people too. Um, man, uh, yeah, it definitely seems exciting. Uh, it seems like there's a lot going on. We're definitely entering the multiverse, but they made sure on this trailer not to reveal too much about the, uh, the story and what kind of what's going on there. You know, that he's kind of having a bad a bad uh, reoccurring dream that um, just keeps coming. It seems like some sort of prophecy or something like that. Um, and then he 
it seems like he tries to he has to kind of pay for the the choices that he's made in the past. I don't know if it's something that happens in this movie that he tries to do to protect the the universe from incoming doom or if it's maybe uh, him using the time stone so much um, in the past to fix all of his problems. Uh, maybe that's coming back to to bite him in the to bite him in the butt. So totally unsure about that. It's nice to see America Chavez. I know I really have a strong feeling that we're going to get an X Men sort of cameo, sort of reveal, sort of thing going on in there. I'm not sure who that glowing person was. It flew towards someone and like tackled them, but it it could be a, a Captain Marvel appearance. I'm not I'm not sure, or it could be someone else entirely. Maybe um. Uh, Nova or someone or someone like that. Um, we we'll definitely be excited to figure out uh, so who some of these characters are and kind of what the relation is um, with them in or how they're integrated in the story. What, why they're important? Why they're there at all? Um, definitely some interesting stuff. And I wonder if we get another face off between this Doctor Strange this time and um, maybe another evil Doctor Strange or um, the superior Doctor Strange from. The What If series, uh, definitely make sure you check out all of all of those um, shows and stuff if you haven't yet. It's definitely, I feel like it, I feel like it'll be important for this story specifically. I feel like WandaVision and um, What If will be important to this story. So definitely make sure you check those out at least if you're planning on checking this out in May when it comes out. And yeah. You know, I'm sold. I'm sold on all the Marvel movies so far until I finally punch my uh, my card and get on out of the Marvel or get on off of the Marvel bandwagon. But until then, I will be reacting to all of this stuff. And I hope you guys are still here to leave comments in the comment section. Please do so if you feel so inclined. And um, also... Be sure to leave a like and a subscription so that you never miss a beat. And uh, yeah, until next time, guys, thank you so much for tuning in and peace and happy gaming.